Hello and welcome to Maths with Jacob. This lesson will focus on average or mean worksheets. So this video is presenting a few worksheets to give us some practice uh, on questions involving the average or the mean. Question 1. Find the average of those five numbers. Part B. Find the average of the six numbers there. Find the average of those numbers. There are five of them. And find the average of those five numbers there. Now if we remember the average is calculated by the formula we used in the lesson for these worksheets and if you're not sure what that is students can refer to the lesson they can access that when they get to the end of this video there is a link which will take them to the lesson on this subject and that gives you the formula question 2 the average of five numbers is nine when a sixth number is added the average is ten what is the value of the new number? Part B. The average of six numbers is 11. When a seventh number is added, the average is 13. What is the value of the new number? And part C. The average of nine numbers is 15. When a tenth number is added, the average is 16. What is the value of the new number? Now we'll go to the next slide. That'll give us the second worksheet. Question 3. My average in four science tests is 70. If I scored 90 in my fifth test, what is my new average? Part B. My average in six history tests is 75. If I scored 82 in my seventh test, what is my new average? Part C. My average in nine English tests is 60. If I scored 80 in my tenth test, what is my new average? Question 4. The mean of three numbers is 8. If two of the numbers are 5 and 7, what is the third number? Part B. The mean of six numbers is 12. If five of the numbers are 5, 8, 11, 16 and 17, what is the sixth number? And the next part. The mean of eight numbers is ten. If one of the numbers is excluded from the list, the mean is now nine. What number was excluded? So this video has introduced us to a couple of worksheets to give us practice in doing problems on the mean or the average.